What's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. The body be down here making my supper for tonight. I got some chopped up turkey. I got some diced up potato, some baby spinach, yellow and red bell peppers. I got some jalapenos. I got onion. We got egg. We got hot sauce and we got a little bit of this crazy cheese we're going to be using. And we're just going to make a big old skillet of some good stuff. Uh, this is just a little extra yumminess for today. But it's all right. We're going to make it. And uh, while the potatoes are cooking, uh, I'm just going to have patience. It's going to take a while, so we'll, we'll get back once the potatoes are done. And I ask you, please, don't judge me by the disgusting bent hood. Don't look at it. Pretend it's not there. Um, I'm not going to use any excuses, but this house was bought as a fixer-upper, and the hood was disgusting when we bought it. And it's just something we haven't messed with. I'm a little embarrassed by it. I guess I could put magnets all over it, but they probably wouldn't stick. So, uh, when the moon hits you, I like a big pizza pie. It's amore. Yada 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 yada. Sha na ta ta ta. It's the samore. Turn them down a little bit. We'll get back with you in just a minute, guys. Stick around. Hope everybody had a wonderful day. I guess I had a decent day. I had a decent workout. You can check out that video if you want. There's some deadlifts today. Deadlift Friday. Now, my choice of oil is just your standard vegetable oil. It's nothing spectacular. Uh, some people don't mind it. Some people do. Some people think it'll kill you. Some people don't. I mean, I don't drink. I don't smoke. I don't do drugs. I don't sleep around, so I don't guess I have a, any sort of disease. So, I guess if this is one of the worst things I do is use some vegetable oil, I guess I'm okay. I have bought olive oil and I have looked at like different oils and different stuff, but I just, I go back to this because it's of course cheaper. Sometimes I don't really even add oil. Sometimes it's just leftover oils that I that are in here, and then sometimes I'll add a little water and kind of cook my foods kind of in sort of a waterish kind of base with a smidgen bit of oil that's left in there kind of base. And so sometimes it's not all oily. So 
we'll get our potatoes good here. They're getting about right. I, my my uh, baby spinach is looking a little on the past the date, but we'll get over it. Uh, normally I'd put this in last because it's really delicate, but we're just going to dump all the onions and peppers and stuff along with that in there. Let it go. Put that in there. Leftover pepper. You can tell we got a little <laughs> a little heat going to it. Turkey in. Big old help on a turkey. And a lot of times, uh, whenever I tell you I'm having turkey, it's ground turkey. The kind that comes in the package, it looks like ground beef, but it's ground turkey. This here was a uh, pre cooked butterball turkey that you can buy at the store, and it's only like $12 for like 15 or 18 pounds or something huge twelve dollars so my wife's got that and i've been eating on it for a couple days now we'll cut the heat down And this is where I'll demonstrate using a little bit of water. Number one, on an iron skillet, it helps to kind of loosen up stuff on the skillet. And it actually gets in your food. It makes it more flavorful and better. So... I don't wash this skillet really ever. Um, I just scrape it out with a little water maybe and then whatever's left in there is left in there. And uh, as far as the eggs go, I'm not going to pre-crack them and beat them or nothing. I'm just going to crack them and put them in there. And uh, since the eggs have went out outrageously priced for zero reason whatsoever in this country, uh, I finally found a couple of people that are selling me farm fresh eggs for a good price, about $2 a dozen. And uh, that's what I've been using now for a little while. So that's what these are. This one here is kind of cool. It has almost kind of a green tint to it. And you'll see that with farm fresh eggs, you'll get different tints to the eggs. I'm going to add a little water.
Gotta add some hot sauce, guys. I'm a hot sauce. I'm a hot sauce kind of fella. I love hot sauce. I also love black pepper. All right, like I said, I'm gonna use some of this, and I know it's not the most fancy, most perfect, healthy cheese in the world, and none of the cheese that most Americans use is healthy. Uh, it's just the way it is. Uh, my wife bought this, I don't even buy this stuff unless I'm gonna have it on my cheat day or something, and usually even at that, I have salsa, and salsa's good for you. So, I'm gonna add some of this in here, maybe the whole, rest of what's in there. I don't know. Pretty much what was in there. So, like I said, there are better alternatives, but there's also worse. Maybe. So as you've seen right there, guys, that's a simple meal to make, and it's full of all sorts of nutrients and vitamins and proteins, and I've got my healthy fats, I've got some uh, unhealthy fats, I've got uh, my carbohydrates and all that, you know, my carbs with the uh, potatoes, and you're getting a, a big bang for the buck here. Maybe, I don't know, depends on eggs. That's that's up in the air, but uh, yeah, and this is gonna be my meal. This whole thing, so, it's a lot of food, but I'm a lot of guy, and uh, so I'm gonna enjoy it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the little video, and uh, I don't always bring you into the kitchen. Uh, I used to uh, do that pretty often on my other channel, Mikey Sun TV. Uh, I have a playlist in there called the Everyday Kitchen. And uh, it, it got some views and people enjoyed that pretty much. But uh, I don't always uh, do these cooking segments on the Body Beatdown. So uh, this is a good representation of what I might eat whenever I'm really hungry and I want to just get a big bulk of some food in me. So anyway, guys, hope you enjoy. Uh, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. That's me. Uh, don't forget... Get up, get out, get red, do it to it, and watch my videos and spread the word about my channel. Spread the word about the channel, guys. A million subscribers by the end of February. Let's do it. Get up, get out, get red, and do it to it.